What's up, everybody? Nello Angelo here. Happy Thanksgiving, happy Turkey Day, or in this case, happy Thanksgiving of horror, since we're going to continue our current streaming series with the extra air glasses with, uh, with the alien isolation. So what better way to start off Thanksgiving with some horror sh I already fucked what I was saying. With horror shit, okay? There we go. That's what I want to put. I know I think it's supposed to be a happy moment, but guess what? Fuck that. Horror. Horror is what matters. Anyways, got to get that out. So, sorry for being a little late since my posting to X, Facebook, and other stuff. I was on a Skype call with my uh, kids because my ex-wife misread my text when I specifically said, call me at 7 tonight so the kids can say happy Thanksgiving to their nana and the other side of their family since my ex hasn't this year for Thanksgiving, but I, so I got to see them shortly for a little bit, and then they'll be calling me back later, so without further ado, let's go ahead and continue with our series. Again, if you're uh, new to my channel, please consider giving me a follow, and if you're catching this on YouTube, I would greatly appreciate a like, share, and subscribe, especially a subscribe, that's the only really way that's going to help me grow, and obviously if you can like and share, that's going to help get my channel out there so I can get noticed more. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into some alien isolation and see what kind of uh, shenanigan horror-based shenanigans we can get ourselves into. All right, exit out of that. <clears throat> and go to my uh, channel. Start monitoring shit. Play game. Alien Isolation is the game, and continue. Oh boy, I really just shit sometimes. This Twitch app sucks sometimes. I pause, goddammit. Alright. There we go. Now it's working yeah sometimes man oh hey what's up arrow yeah uh i ain't got nothing else better to do i don't have to meet family until 5 30 later today so i said screw it might as well just get a stream in while i can so that's what i'm going to do and what better way to start off thanksgiving is with some horror you know I know there's people that see Thanksgiving and Christmas as like that, you know, happy family get together. I say fuck that. I mean, I know family's important, but at the same time, horror is what fucking matters. Horror is fucking awesome. And what great way to start off Thanksgiving with some horror. All right. I don't know why my volume's dropping on my end, but all right, here we go. All right. Now, what is our objective? Oh, yeah, that's right. We're in this fucked up area where I know shit's gonna go down with some of these androids. Why is it not telling me an objective? Anyways. <clears throat> so this is the place where androids go to die, so... Now, we're supposed to uh, find Samuel to help him out. What is my objective? Seek signals that there is no. Find Samuel. Samuel has gone to the android lab in order to reach Apollo. Locate and help him. All right, so. All right. Not sure if this stuff turn off. Not sure if I need to turn that off or if that's a good thing, but let's. Continue moving forward. Now I know there are vents down below that we can crawl through to get away from some of these guys. But I think right now we are lacking on resources. Let's see, I got 10 bullets for the revolver, 2 for the shotgun, 110 for the flamethrower. So I guess not too bad. Let me see. Ooh, EMP. Flashbang. Baker. Uh, oops. Let's see. We have resources. Because every time one tells me I have resources, it ends up not going through. So, 
We'll uh, hold off on crafting one of those for right now. Now, now I'm not sure if I remember correctly. I think there's like a certain action that I have to do first before actual shit unfortunately starts going down. All right, let's access the Savistol the Savistol link. Reform at Seba. Penny, I've sent up some Blanks androids up for the VIP Festival sale tour. If you haven't done it before, just have the limb lie on the slab in the reformat chamber. It'll connect to Apollo and upgrade them with the latest programming. Let's hope they bite. Russell. God damn it. I thought I clicked on it. Well, it... I could... Uh... This is Seeks and Executive there Ransom speaking. I just woke up to find a working Joe in my suite, and when I asked what the hell it was doing, it lunched for me. I had to leave my own fucking apartment. Send your best technicians to Apollo Core and find out what the ah, hell okay, so is I do going have to disconnect on. These now, things. get those things under control. I want a full report ASAP. Okay, so yeah, so I... Oh shit, this flashlight bars. So I guess I do, apparently, have to turn this shit off. So, but let's continue wandering around, because I know... I have a feeling, because just like in any type of survival horror game, the moment I start messing with one of these generators, some of these, one of these, one or two of these supposedly fucked up androids are going to come to life and wake up. Alright, so, lighting in here for right now. Tag. I think the ID tags also contribute to your overall um, completion rate. I don't think the ID tags count towards as um, scrap for stuff to, to build stuff. 3D tuner. You really shouldn't be here. Crap, just a place to hide. Alright, now let's see. So are these actually telling me in what order I should knock out these generators, or is it just giving me like a general location? Okay, I'm assuming. Or, unless it's just telling me that. This is where I need to... Okay, so it's just basically telling me I just need to go there, so... We'll go from the very beginning... Real quick. But before, let's do a quick save. Hostel's nearby. Yeah, cause probably because one of these fuckers is going to wake up. Um... I actually don't really listen to either that much. Um, I've only heard a handful of songs from my Bullet for the by Valentine, and then Chevelle's okay. I couldn't really get into Chevelle, so I'm gonna have to give like a neutral answer and say neither. Now I'm pretty sure if you were to ask my cousin at Terrible Terror, since he has a hard on for Chevelle, he would just definitely just say Chevelle hands down. I mean, there. I forgot the name of the damn song from Bullet for My Valentine, but it is a really good song. Especially, it's actually, I think it's a really good gym song, too. I, for, uh, I forgot what the song is called, but I'm trying to remember how, um, I'm trying to remember how the lyrics go. Something about where they're saying, um, shit. Ah, shit, I'm, I'm trying to remember how the lyrics go so you can get an idea of what song I'm talking about. Something about... I, I'm not sure if these are the right lyrics. Something about, he's saying, you know, my tears fall hard and they crash around me and some other shit. I think it's like a breakup song or... or not only a breakup song, but I don't know. But it, it has like a good... It has like a good... Uh, be, uh, so, you know, it sounds pretty good. And I'd say it's like one, it's one of those songs that, I've, that, I've, that popped up back in the day when me and my... Uh, Friend used to do CrossFit that would help, like, yeah, help push a little bit harder and stuff like that. There you go. That's the song. 
Yeah, that song. That song used to come on from time to time when we would um, hit like the Pandora playlist and do like our CrossFit session, and then that song would come on. It it sounded pretty good. Like, I'd say that's probably like one of my. I would say that's probably like one of the only recognizable like bullet for my bullet for my Valentine songs that I that I'm that I'm I know of because I I've only heard them a handful of times. Ah, shit, batteries are dead. <clears throat> but yeah, not really into. Biocontainment has a level omega. Yeah, not not really not really into. Um... Ah shit! Ah shit! I'm dead. And why am I not surprised that he wakes up? Right, uh, uh, you know, right in front of me. Right, fuck this motherfucker. Kapow, bitch! Oh, okay, he went down. Alright, so that's two. Not sure how much health I have left, but something tells me another one of these fucks is gonna wake up. Probably should construct another first aid kit. First aid kit, medikit, whatever you want to call it. Alright. <clears throat> oh, maybe he was the only one that woke up. I thought could have sworn more woke up. <clears throat> Alright. I hear another save point, which is nice. Okay, so we have... Oh, never mind. Never mind. I guess we have the option. We have to go in there. I thought this is just an option to get around the androids. Have access to Apollo. Open the tower transit for me. Apollo transit reserved for Sikhs and executives and synthetics only. Right. Then I'll have to find a way to talk to Apollo directly. Biocontainment has a level Omega. All permissions rescinded. I don't have time for this. Fuck him up, Samuels! One good thing about having an android on our side. I remember one time, I forgot it was for the Switch version, or when I played this on the PC after the Xbox. Like I took a long break, and then when I went back into it, it was at this part. And for the longest time, I thought Samuels was actually an enemy, because that's how long I, of a break I took. So I was kind of, because uh, uh, I saw him fuck up the android. Like, oh shit, this guy must be a protagonist that I gotta come across next, but they're like, nope, never mind, I'm actually helping this guy, so that was actually that's actually a good thing. Oh, well, I mean, you know. It is what it is. Like I said, I couldn't get into them. I mean I'm pretty sure they do got some decent songs that I probably have heard, but like I said, like I've only seen them live. Uh if I did hear any if I did hear any of their stuff whether it popped up on my Pandora, I I didn't really pay attention to it unless I actually glanced down to look at the name of who was playing. I mean, I do think... I'm not sure if it's still the same band members. I think one of them might have left. Or maybe it's still the same, but... I do think it was. it's pretty cool, though, that there are three brothers that are in that, uh, that are their own band. Which I think that is pretty... kind, is, Which is pretty awesome. But like I said, I'm not sure if uh, things have changed. I just remember when my cousin first told me about them. He was telling me it's three brothers in a band. Uh, let's read this computer first, because I know shit's gonna happen with fucking androids. Plans tonight. Susan, sweetheart, I'm going to have a to rain check. I'm getting reports from downstairs about abnormal android behavior. It might have something to do with all those folks going missing. I need you to get to the showroom and shut yourself in. There's a lockdown button near my desk. From when these machines were actually worth something. Don't worry about them. They're only display models. Just sit tight. I'll sort this out and we can accelerate the deal. Finally going through when we're not on company time. Last chance. Spedding. I'm expecting the VIPs to get here easily. So I, wa I want you and your people ready and waiting to greet them. 
The clock's ticking down, and this is our last chance to salvage something from this piece of shit. I want your people to answer their every whim, every vice and laugh at every vice and laugh at every one of their fucking jokes. Take them to the showroom when they're ready. Don't rush them and don't bore them with sp speeches. If they say they want something changed in the working Joes, just say yes. We can let the tech heads worry about it later. I hope you have your best people on this. Showroom appointments. Fails. Showroom viewing appointments. Monday, zero. Tuesday, zero. Wednesday, zero. Thursday, zero. Friday, date night. Lame guy. Saturday, zero. Sunday, zero. Decent facility staff. Reception, Susan Archer, Line Manager, Android Liaison Executive Spedding. Alright, so clearly, they suck if they can't even get no appointments. Alright. Alright, so what do you got going on for today there, uh, Mr. Arrow? Alright, I know at least two of you come to life once I lift the lockdown. That I remember, but... I'm just wondering if it's one of those things where I can just dance around them. <clears throat> Alright, so either somebody shot this poor bitch or she got her throat crushed. Or, yeah, that is a chick, okay. Alright. All right, let's see what happens. Oh, that's good. Yeah, I know. I kind of... I know I shouldn't have, but it's not like I overindulged, but like this week I kind of just said, fuck my diet. I did go to the gym on Monday, so I, I guess that still counts. And then maybe if there's time, depending on when I finish the stream, maybe I might go for a run. But worst case scenario, I might just scrap that and then... Maybe do another stream depending on how I'm feeling uh, before meeting family at 5.30 and then obviously just saying fuck the diet to enjoy some home good Thanksgiving dinner because I'm not going to pass up on stuffing and not big on mashed potatoes but I do like mashed potatoes but I would really love stuffing more so I'm not going to pass up on stuffing just because of my diet. Alright, now... The fun is about to begin. I got how many bullets. I got I got two. Okay, so or excuse me, shells. All them shells. All right. All right now, do they come to life? Music is or music is playing, that usually means something's about to go down. So either after I open that door or it's one of those things where I can want to sandwich in between these fuckers. <clears throat> you know what? Fuck this. I got a shotgun. Fuck, fuck you up, bitch. Wow, bitch! Alright, who's next? Alright, who else wants some? Oh shit! They all wake up this time! I knew that. I forgot if I was able to run around that desk or not, or that little bar, but probably not. I'm dead. Okay, so let's try this again. Hello? Okay, that's been the cast then. Thought it was my sister or something. Alright. Okay, so let's. I think it's the next generator when one wakes up. Oh, 
Oh wait, did I miss one? Oh, there it is. Biocontainment has a level, Omega. Fuck you, motherfucker. Okay, I got nowhere to go. Oops. Bitch. Of course, you got nothing. You're useless. Alright. Actually, weren't there batteries here that I missed last time? Or did I get those? No, I got those before I saved. Okay. <clears throat> Now, uh, hard again. All right. As much as I would love to see Samuel's fuck this poor bastard up again, I must have access we're just to gonna go. Open the tower transit immediately. Apollo transit reserved for Sikhs and executives and synthetics only. Right, then I'll have to find a way to talk to Apollo directly. Biocontainment has a level Omega. All permissions rescinded. I don't have time. Omega. That's right, Samuel. Fuck them up. notes real quick so I can get the credit for it yet again. <clears throat> Alright. Okay, I think we'll have to just make a med, a med kit. That's uh, yeah. That's what happens when you play a game without a HUD, but it is what it is. Aha, I probably could have just ran around here. So I'll probably try and do that this time. Hopefully I don't get stuck like some kind of fucking moron. Or, actually, is there a way I can lead them out? No. That's just gonna be a death trap. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna need a little house. I'm gonna need a little bit more G fuel for this real quick. using my dead space shaker cup today since I left my attack on Titan one at work and my re4 one is here but I broke the cap on that one which sucks but tomorrow my evil Emperor Frieza collectors box comes in tomorrow and also I with it is the um, 24 ounce steel um, shaker cup of the classic Mortal Kombat and with the um, the uh, uh, scorpion themed scorpion flavored or excuse me scorpion themed uh scorpion sting spicy mango flavor that one i'm looking forward to now i am mad when i did order the evil emperor reason one i was like oh cool so if this one's available the ginyu force pineapple flavor has to be available nope it wasn't so just my luck like not even a half an hour after I placed the order for the evil emperor uh, frieza collector's box and the uh, mortal kombat that I get an email saying, oh, guess what? You can now order this. I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? Why wasn't it not ready for order at the same fucking time? Cosmo Logo Logos. Hey, what's up? How are you? Thank you for joining. But yeah, so I was a little pissed off about that. I think I think my roommates ordered that, so I might have to snag some of that off of them to give it a taste test. But I will on my next pay paycheck. I am definitely going to get the Ginyu Force pineapple flavor g fuel and then i'll probably bundle it with something else because i like to use the um shop paying for installment stuff i don't really like uh flipping money all up front i mean technically i can but i just figured fuck it if i can just space out the payments why not roll right through these guys where can i go where can i go where can i go where can i go 
All right, let's hide under this desk. I'm not sure if they'll look for me over here. <clears throat> Anyways. Yeah, I'm playing on uh, Nightmare. I just figured I'd... Uh... What is it? I don't think I've ever played on hard. I just played on normal, and I just said, fuck it. I just said for this stream, I just jumped straight to Nightmare. Especially using with the uh, using the glasses. That way I can... Uh, yeah, so I just figured a little bit more of a challenge. And it's been fun and shitty at the same time. Been getting my ass handed to me here and there. Especially when you don't realize how much health you have left. And then when you're trying to break free from an android and then they instantly kill you. <clears throat> but so far, not a bad run. I mean, I actually thought the alien would be a little bit more difficult like they usually uh, put it. Why do I hear a... Oh, that's right there. Cool. All right, so we can save really quick before we go back out to no man's land. Philly, read this. What do you mean you shut the access door to the elevator? All your guns and supplies mean jack shit to me when the synthetic that ha was, chasing, was chasing you is still fucking down here. I don't think it's me. I don't think it sees me. It stood staring at your old ma magazines and the blood... Plant overlook. Get back down here and open this door now. Silly. Here, God damn it! Do it again. Shared. Holding out. Holding out. I don't know how many of you are still around to get this, but I've got weapons and supplies. I'm setting up shop outside the synthetic showroom. I'm hoping we'll be safe from the creature up here. Smithy is with me and waiting to be let up from the fluid plant reception. I still haven't seen Susan. If you're with her, let me know. That bitch is dead. Okay. Bitch got her throat crushed from what it looks like. Ooh, shotgun shells. Actually, what? Go. Load up my shoddy. EMP mine. So I'm guessing I made it through the door before they. Oh, what happened? I, so I'm guessing I made it through the door before they actually got to spot me. Or who knows? Maybe they just can't come back here at all or at the moment. It's, like I said, it's been a while since I played this game. Some stuff I remember, but. And then some stuff I have completely forgotten about. Oh, okay. Well, I just know that they how they describe Nightmare is that obviously you have no HUD and then the alien is supposedly supposed to have more heightened senses. Now, it would have been cool if for actually any of them, really, because I know the Xbox version, like if you had a Kinect, well, at the time, the original Xbox One had the connect and that's around the time when this game came out it, it was a cool con i thought it was an interesting concept where you know if your connect is connected and if you talk or if it hears noise that uh, hears like your voice that the, it, it'll attract the alien i thought that was a uh, pretty cool little concept that they did with that uh but it would have been nice if they would have gave that an option for like the pc version as well where if you have a mic you can turn that feature on or not I, I've actually gotten lucky with the Kinect version, with the Xbox One, but then again, I never really talked. Well, then again, I also never streamed this either when I had the Xbox, so I never really talked. So I kind of got lucky in that sense, but um, um, whatchamacallit. Um, oh, shit. All right, they're about to break through i got lucky in that sense but i remember my brother-in-law was telling me one time that he was just chilling in his room playing this game and his brother yelled down the hall to get his attention and the alien the alien um kind of made kind of hissed because it hurt him and then my brother was like oh shit and then he kind of yelled down the hall for his dad, dad shut the hell up uh let's see uh, well I wouldn't call it winning terrible. I would just call it more like just trying to survive. 
Yeah, I kind of noticed that the uh, alien senses aren't that high. Because, um, like, there was a couple times when I was kind of, like, trapped out in the open. Kind of something like this. And he walked right by me, you know, from, like, say, this way. And then he was probably standing about right here this way. And then he literally turned around where he could have saw me, but he ended up walking right past me. And I was like, oh, shit, I got lucky on that one twice. Something like on scenarios like that twice. All right, I'll go ahead and let you fuckers just burn in hell. Because I know you motherfuckers will just roast. All I have to do is just dance around you fuckers and not get killed. I'll have to this. Ah shit, I'm fucked. <laughs> shit! I forgot how long it takes for these guys to burn, but... I know they should be dropping dead soon. Hopefully. shot in his face all right so looks like this plan why are they just standing there oh shit all right so never mind I thought they were I guess maybe it's because it's on nightmare difficulty so um... okay so that didn't do shit I mean, I guess it's kind of stunning them, but not for how long. Do I have to use the access tuner for this? Is that what they want me to do? Shit, keycard. I thought I picked that up. God damn it. Maybe it's on the easier difficulty that... Alright, so I gotta do this shit again. So maybe I guess it's on the lower difficulty that they actually roast to death. Because I remember I was able to... The last time I played this on the Switch, I was able just to let them fucking burn and they just collapse. Oh, yeah, well, I'm pretty sure, well, I, I'm pretty sure I fucked that last shot up, too, so. Alright. I just warned, I picked up the, I already looked at those before I saved, so I don't need to look at those again. Uh, <clears throat> bullet. That. 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 Hold on. Okay, maybe I didn't pick it up. Fine. So... Fuck. Okay. Now I gotta try and remember where this shit's at. So I'm wondering, do I have to go back in that other room then? Hmm. Uh... All right, let's try to remember how to fucking do this again. Get a key card. Go back in that other room. I'm trying to remember. 
or I think doesn't one of them have the key card? Oh shit. I knew he automatically knew where I was at. God damn it. That's the only thing I hate is that the grab radius for these guys is too fucking long. I know I had plenty of space to run in between those guys. Oh wait, but never mind. Okay, never mind. I thought he was gonna have. That didn't last too long. I think I have enough to break out real quick again, hopefully. Alright. Come on. chance on this one reviving and killing me so right. who's twitching out still maybe one of these things had a key card okay so that was all of them aha okay so one of these fuckers did have the key card okay all right so Cool, free med kit. Okay, so I got grabbed twice, so I might as well just use one of these. If I don't accidentally die again. And let me go ahead and save really quick. You know, I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure I'm safe for a moment right now. Thanks, I appreciate it. give anything away but this is an area where a specific character later on meets an unfortunate fate if this is the area I'm thinking of Wayland Yutani synthetic registered attempted unauthorized access oh that's the one that Samuel's fucked up he should be dead hopefully all right so before I open that because I think that's I'll go ahead and hit this the hell that safe part same thing though Oh, here it is. Elevator to hell going straight down. How 
functioning. Great. What was that, Ripley? Nothing. Just more shit on this station fucking up. The usual. Just Ripley, just complaining. That's all. not like you have like the alien or people shooting at your ass during this part so this was kind of nice okay so that one doesn't work i think hopefully The leap of faith. <laughs> Anything of interest around here? No. Your safe point. Batteries. Okay, so they want us to go that way, so let's there's anything around here before we hit that save. Now what the hell? That was weird. Oh. Hmm. Not sure if that's uh, some kind of weird glitch or if that's supposed to do that. That was, uh, that's interesting. Anyway, so... I forgot if no too many saves affects your overall rating, but... Fuck it, it's not like I'm doing a fucking no-death speed run or no-death kind of run anyway, so... I'm not that great. Ah, oh, shit, another fun area. This is the area where you... This is where it's going to be a little interesting. I know there's some crawl spaces. Not sure if that was an opportunity for me to beat the fuck out of them before you got out of the bed, but... one dead or alive? Okay, yeah, so we do... Okay, yes. Oh, shoot, who's this? Sorry, fucker. Alright, so... I mean, I know I should probably shut off that camera system, but let me go ahead and... I think that android should be out of... Oh, no, he's right there. <clears throat> go away. Alright, fine. 
I'll just do this then. Fine, fuck it. Not sure if there's a terminal I need to access or not. I thought there was one there that I need to look at to get credit for. I can wait for you for a very long time. No, you can't. Testing my patience. There are more pressing matters at hand. This is dead. Okay, that keeps going. Let's see what's over here. shit's about up here. Except for killing this computer, I mean the camera. And let's go a little bit further this way and see where this points us at. if any other androids have waken up or if it's just homeboy that's wandering around looking for us. Alright, so if you want me to go that way. A thing to shut this camera off doesn't look like it, so... That's gonna wake somebody up. Doesn't look like it. Probably using the security tuner might wake something up. Ah, there's Samuels. Ripley, good to see you alive. Apollo's security perimeter has been built so that only Sikhs and Synthetics can interact with it. Listen to me. I'm going to have to do something rather drastic if I hope to connect with Apollo. Alrighty. Restore power. Yep, and I already know what that drastic thing is going to be. And even people who have probably never played this game before can already know where that's going to go, especially being in a horror game. I'm going to use the reformat chamber. It's the only option. I've had to divert power from the area to allow me to try. Alrighty. Ah, shit, I'm out. Oh well. Not like I actually needed it since I fucking... I don't know how long I slept, but... That's what happens when you go back to work after a long vacation. But it is what it is now. Back to the reality of going to work. And... 
hoping people will eventually follow you by the time your career is over so you have an alternative career to fall back on. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and save this bitch real quick. Samuels, that's too dangerous. Yes, far too dangerous. Wish me luck. Samuels, don't! You are making a noble sacrifice, Samuels. trying to remember if you accidentally fuck up and Samuels dies does that mean game over Red done. or Next, look for a blue cable. can you see it why is my flashlight now or do I have to read why My flash is not working this area, but whatever. Got it! Blue disconnected! What next? I'm having trouble accessing the schematics. Uh, Apollo is making things difficult. I need the next one, Samuels! What? What's happening out there with me? The emergency lights have come on! I can't make out the colors of the cables! You're gonna have to guide me to them! The next one is plugged into a wall socket. There was an upturned gurney nearby. Probably Samuel's probably fucked him up. Unless he was already deactivated in the first place. Got it, Samuels! Just just the last one now, Ripley! Well, good thing that Samuels is a robot. And no shit, because if it was me giving some directions, I'd be fucked. to sound like too heartless i mean yeah he's an android i don't feel too bad for him actually to be quite honest i think i felt more bad ricardo for... oh, yeah. if you're there pick up i'm here i'm here sorry samuels is gone Shit. he opened apollo transit for me i'm gonna go straight there i'll get apollo to lift the lockdown uh, anyway, so what I was saying is that I do feel bad for Samuels, but I don't feel terribly bad for him because technically he is an android and it's not like he had in real life anyways. But anyways, I did feel bad, if I remember correctly, in Titanfall 2 for your, your, in the story mode for your Titan, what's his name? BT? I think I did feel 
bad for when he killed out when you when he died the first time because uh you know the pilot titan the you know connection type thing so So does that mean these androids are shut down now, or am I going somewhere else? I had a feeling that more androids were going to be revived, as you would say. first camera was. I'm not interested in your stupid safety protocols because your safety protocols so far is just killing people. Too long to do that. Well, back to work. Yeah, you go back to work. Alright, so he's in the way. Let me see, is he just going left to right or is he. Okay, so. say anything about hostels near hostels nearby so let's go ahead and get back to where this is all right now this should be working Riff, I just found something here an interview tape you need to hear it play it Ricardo you're Marlo right yeah. I'm Taylor. Sector exec Wayland Utani. Oh, the big guns now, huh? Not some girl with abandonment issues? Leave Ripley out of this. Hmm. She's just looking for closure. I'm looking after Wayland Utani interests. And I'm looking to get out of this fucking cell. Looking to do it here. Maybe. This is being recorded. You understand? I saw it. Red lights on. I want data. The location of the planetoid where you found the derelict. All data you have on the origin of that organism. I can give you that. And a way off this station. You just have to let me out. I can probably agree to those terms. What the fuck? Taylor! Taylor, get me out of the cell right now! Get me out! Hmm. I, I heard it. shotgun shells now. 
trying to fuck some shit up. Not really. Dead, unfortunately. Apollo Private Transit available. Board for Apollo Core. Right now. Is this technically a safe space? I think we are good for now. I just remember when I first played through this game, waiting on these damn trams, my heart was always fucking racing because I was afraid something was going to come out. So I'll move back there. Open the fuck up. Time to go to the Apollo core. I was gonna say, is there gonna be a uh, in between loading or not? the area I'm thinking of is gonna fucking suck. The Vesto Link. Nothing in the personals. Tomorrow together, number three. Tomorrow together. Together tomorrow. Leakson's journey into colonial space and official history by Sebastian Sieg, first printed in I on Seekson. Our ascent to Sevestable. While Seekson prepared for its ascension into colonial space, its foothold was under construction. Sevestable, a station with unparalleled potential and the perfect position deep in Steve space. Sevestable began as a freeport built by Lorenz Sistech Development and unfounded by our friends at Geofund Investor. The station's open would, however, coincide with tumult in the space race. Years of mismanagement and the rerouting of the Sol Sidious flight path left Sevestable in little dangers and being decommissioned. Thankfully, Seekson were waiting in the wings to re-energize this station. Among many others, in 2124, we arrived in Sevestable, and made possible the buzzing cos cosmopolitan hub you see today. I've come over to Apollo to find out what sent the synthetics crazy. This place has gone to hell. Apollo's redirected core android duties, and they've just walked away from the maintenance we requested after we got the news. Coolant's everywhere, gas has escaped, and the primary access lift has shut itself down. I flagged a help request, but apparently I'm 45th in line. Systems are suddenly obsessed with hazard containment. I'm gonna find a way down. Spitting out. Alright. So... It's here where I'm thinking that a, that somebody meets an unfortunate fate, which I uh, which sucks, because they were so happy to get ready to go home, and then yeah. Firearms detected. You've got to be shitting me. Place firearms on security container. Uh huh. Well, this is where unfortunately I have to give up all my shit think and then I have to get it back at a later time which sucks ass I'll bet 
All right, so this is the part where unfortunately everything has, if I remember, everything is just basically stealth and running and hiding until I can get those back. Door unlocked. Door access elevator offline. Primary Apollo systems inaccessible. Ricardo, the way in's blocked off. The schematics they use for the Sylvesterpool sales tour should be nearby. 30. See if there's a back door. Okay, let's see. There's a power conduit that links to the Apollo core. I can use that. You think you'll fit? Turn off the electrics, take some deep breaths, squeeze. Easy. I'm not coming up there to pull you out if you get stuck. Well, at least I can rely on you for not doing shit. 4930. Have to power it down first. Ooh, nothing like a little electroshock therapy. All right, I'm gonna go right, but we'll go left first. Let's see what's around here. Molotovs, flashbang, noisemaker. Hmm. What the? F like another flashbang. All right. Now, we oh, we can make another. Oh, we can make another EMP, probably. Now, uh, not sure if the next area is what I'm thinking of. Not sure if the EMP will do me any good because I know the stun baton, if I remember correctly, doesn't do anything. So the EMP probably was a mistake to make. If it's the if I'm going to where I think I'm going. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. oh yeah, so I don't have any of my guns on. I'm like, why can't I equip my fucking revolver or shotgun? Oh, yeah, I can carry a stun baton with me. That makes sense. Apollo sales, one sheet. Apollo information sheet. Why an Apollo system for your deep space orbital station? Self-regulation and android maintenance. Security through removal of synthetic self-determination. Instant communication, no interference. Lightning fast data movement across the station, reliable, efficient, self-sustaining. A true season product. So, nothing of importance on this thing. Just getting my credit for reading that. As long as I don't die to did. I'm uh, picking up something on my scanner. I mean, I'm probably not in an area yet that requires me. He's too worried, but I'm getting close. Ah, uh, yeah, so these guys are wearing fucking suits, so I don't think the EMP grenade will can hurt those guys, but go ahead and do this real quick. sure why they didn't just direct me to that way first but I have a feeling like shit's about to fucking go down now soon I mean they wouldn't be playing horror type music 
this shit wasn't gonna go down, but let's just save so I don't have to repeat that part again. Like I said, I'm not concerned about how many saves it takes, since I'm not doing like a no save or no death run or uh, all that other kind of jazz. Want to go left, but let's see what's right. Anything of significance to pick up around here? Enter an area where I'll probably be F U C K, or maybe I'm not there yet. Ray, it's Chief. There's something wrong with your synthetics. The team I requisitioned to acid strip lower habitation just stopped in their tracks. They barked something about a hazard containment order, tried to get into my control booth, and then just marched off. I know I always complain about those spooky bald bastards, but now I've got proof their wiring's faulty. I've got a meeting with your boss Spedding tomorrow, and I'm gonna kick some ass. So when he starts kicking your ass, well, it's coming from me. Ew. Ricardo, conduit's offline for now. I've pulled up the Apollo schematics here. It looks like you can get to the access to the turbine shaft. The turbine's running hot, Ricardo. Full speed. There'll be an emergency shutoff nearby, but it won't stay off forever. You have to get inside quickly. Ooh, danger. <laughs> I'm in danger. That's all right. I know that was a shitty Ralph voice on. Door locked. So I believe I've already been in here. Yeah. I think. I think so. Let me just check. Yeah. Okay. So I've already read this log. Okay, now we have to go this way. Oh, so I gotta do it again. Oh, okay, so maybe I had to do the other one first, but well, whatever. It is what it is. <clears throat> I know some games... Uh, you have to do certain things in a certain order, and then some games, it kind of doesn't matter as long as you're not doing like certain real uh, the main main requirements ahead uh, to ahead of time first. Turbines off. Way should be clear. You're doing them before the main. Whatever. gonna be tight. Great. Just keep him cross for me, huh? There's gonna be lots of Jones down there, Rip. Could be dangerous. No shit. Samuel sacrificed himself so I could get here. I've gotta try. I thought he was a pretty nice guy for a synthetic. Me too. That's because he was programmed to me. He wasn't programmed to be a fucking piece of shit like these androids are. <laughs> Alright, so at least we're at a save point. That's good. Save point and a locker to hide in, assuming they don't see me go into the locker. Alright. Okay, so I think this is where we just kind of... Main entrance is locked. Any idea what to do next? I can't hardly hear you, Rick. Your signal's just checking in. Great. 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 
Ricardo? Christ's sake. If you can hear me, find another way to make contact. Something's up with my earpiece. Alright, so we have a left and a right, so... I guess we'll go right first. Oh shit. You will go left first. Oh, never mind. There's poison gas. I'm pretty sure I have to get a mask somewhere. somewhat going into no man's land now. <clears throat> Nothing there. Hazard containment alert. Apollo would ask for your patience during the current hazard containment alert, which is currently at level Omega. Thank you. Thank you, guy. Spedding. Uh, something crazy just happened. Sebastopol is off the market. We gotta buy it. The weeks before they start taking the place apart and they U-turn. After all those endless presentations and tours, I guess... The talks weren't stalled at all. Someone at company headquarters just had to click his fingers. A message of confirmation just came in. Apollo is currently receiving a packet of new operation rule sets. So, I guess, the deal's sealed. Now, this is board level need to know stuff until it's announced to shareholders. Quite the promotion, huh? Alright, so... Let's see what's over here on the left side real quick. Unless it's gonna eventually make me go back there and I'm just wasting my time, but sometimes I always like to go the opposite in certain games just to increase my percentage rate of like finding and accessing stuff. Now it's telling me to go this way too, so I guess it didn't really matter. Charge pack. Threats. All right, so here we go. Start the cat and mouse game. One that way. Bank. when I was playing this on my Switch. Fuck. Like it shows he's literally right in front of me unless he's around that and I just can't see him. There he is. I got to go. Okay, so they want me to go right. Gotta make sure it's safe to go. And now it's showing that he's right in front of me. I don't see nothing. So that's blocked off. I want me to go that way now. Okay, so it seems like all he's just gonna do is circle, so that may or may not be beneficial. Oh shit. At the same time, that'll also fuck me up looking at this computer. route is. Come back this way. Go. 
I just want to get an idea of what this route looks like. It might give me enough time to at least look at one or two logs or access some stuff before he. What the hell? What? Why are my thumbsticks not responding all of a sudden? Oh, now it says access terminal, of course. After I'm like struggling here to fucking anyway from the back around. No, oh, don't have anything to make a noise and make the whiff. Shit, did I just light him on fire? I could have called in a special team, cool. secured the specimen, and we all would have been happy, but Apollo has got all communications. None of the technicians in Apollo Corps are answering my messages. We're all dying here, you bastards. You threw it all away. Hmm. Fuck you. I did not know that. Or maybe I did that last time and just Fuck completely you. forgot about that. But whatever. Roast in hell, motherfucker. Aha, there's a vent. So I wonder if this vent... I must lead into the core. Can't ah, do course, anything without power. All right. Now they want us to go. Hey, where are you going, there, guy? Susanna lover. Alright, cool. So we're at another safe spot. So far, so good. Haven't been seen yet. You really shouldn't be here. God damn it! Oh, I thought I... Uh, move this thumbstick too fast. Or not too fast, but I wasn't holding it steady enough. And I lost the signal. Left hemisphere server. What am I at? So. Banks. Now I know active. I wasted a little right bit of time. Server banks. Now active. Talking to the children. And I just come from the left. Or never mind, I meant completed. I'm stupid. Please wait. Actually, I don't need to save. I'd, I'm say right here if I die, so all I'll have to do is do that quick scan again. So, all right, now time to. Fuck with the left side. Am 
my scanner. Shit. Just like the alien, they can't see me if I'm crouched behind something. Okay, maybe they are a little bit smarter than the alien, because as far as I know... Or not know, but as far as I remember... As far as I remember, if you're hiding behind something crouched, the alien can't see you. So I'm wondering why all of a sudden they decided to make the working Joes a little bit smarter. crew or something. Oh shit. Open up you piece of shit. Damn it, I just fucked myself. Maybe not. Right. Let me wait it out a little bit since they haven't seen me. Music goes away. I think I know that's all clear. <clears throat> oh, I did fine on the left side, but then I screwed myself on the right side. <clears throat> Thing, just return to duty. Alright, so 
Use access tuner on dome terminal to gain access. So, not sure if there's a computer. I'm pretty sure there was on the right side that I need to access for to get credit for ex exploration. But so we'll get out in five. Oh, up oh, there, mind. Yeah, these ones are a little bit more persistent. Alright, so let us go back to the right hemisphere. looked at that terminal it's one here now I just need to get an idea where these fucks are at just a misunderstanding unless uh, I mean if there's no terminal over here then I probably just wasted my time but I'm pretty sure I can get through the vents now so there's one Fry his ass too. Maybe not. I can't fry his ass like the other one. All right, buddy, just continue along your route. All visiting corporate representatives must report to their nearest synthetic. Come on, buddy. So they do want me to go through the vent. Alright. So it wasn't too, too bad. Didn't get hit once, even though I did get caught, uh, spotted. By like a whole fleet of these fucks. Ooh. Scary. Not Event Horizon scary, but close enough. Okay, so they want to do stuff first. Uh, oh, probably this 
I first. Yep. Aha. I gotta find an advanced. Find a way to reduce Apollo security capabilities. So, why? Oh, wait, okay, now I think this is when I have to do the stuff in the vents. Maybe. Let's see. Low power. Low power. Okay. So there has to be something else I need to do then. right next to us so let me see I'm not sure if the button does anything that just takes me here so I'm wondering if these buttons near the vents turn the power on either side it was just another way to open up the vent but let's see nope didn't do shit low powers what the fuck unless there's like a an add-on I need for my um, scan tool. What am I missing? Okay, that doesn't do shit. Played in a while. Unless those computers that I somehow missed. Hmm. Shit. Well, I already saved, so. All right. Here we go. Guess I have to go in those two rooms that I'm assuming that I somehow missed. Let's see. I could fry these guys, but I don't think they'll. But I don't think they'll. Actually, this is water, so maybe I could fry these guys. Oh shit. There's like a whole bunch of these fuckers. If I could fry these fucks, then fuck them. We're experiencing a heightened containment hazard level today. You always know. guys. I'm 
Why not ask me about Sebastopol? You always have a working job. Play noise maker bad, I only have one. We're experiencing a high season tomorrow together. Oh. Hmm. Let's see, I'm trying to figure out where would be a good place because it's wet here, so I'm pretty sure if I act, unless it's only a one and done type thing, I'm pretty sure I could fry these fuckers. Shit. Really? I guess it's only a one-time thing? Or is it because he grabs me? Don't do that. God damn it. I think it's because he hit me. Or maybe you only could do it once. I don't know, but... We'll just do this real quick. Fuck it. I know it's cheating to kind of just start over, but you know what? Fuck it. What side? Did I go? Uh, wait, hold on. I think I have to do this part real quick because I think I saved before I tried messing with this. Now, like I said, I'm not sure if turning on that one thing is only a one-time thing, or if I could do it multiple times. Because if I can do it multiple times, then it would be beneficial to fry the fuck out of these cocksuckers. Was a waste. I'm going to catch you. I guess it's just a one and done type thing, which sucks. Really? Ask me about Sevastopol's safety protocols. There's no way in hell they could have found me or known there was someone there. All right. So that was a waste of a perfectly good noisemaker. Sure. Alright, that's the only bad thing about wearing a headset with these glasses. 
How about you just fucking go away? How about that? Running causes accidents. Okay, fuck it. I'll go on this side. That was a waste of a fairly good noisemaker, but whatever. I guess just doing that is just a one and done thing, which fucking sucks, but it is what it is. But, these are areas I think I've already accessed, though. So, there has to be something that I'm missing. One thing that fucking sucks is that I'm getting no fucking directive. There has to be something around here that's just... I'm overlooking. Are you serious? Didn't I just try to... whatever. <sighs> That's what they hate on some of these fucking games sometimes, man. Actually, you know what? Just so I can get that noisemaker back, fuck it. I'm gonna do this. I don't care if it's cheating or not, fuck it. That was fucking stupid. As many times I came up to those goddamn terminals saying low power, and then all of a sudden... Oh! You can do this now. Fucking stupid. Alright. Now, go in here. Not sure if pushing that button even does anything. Oh look, now I can fucking use it! That made no sense when I was doing that the last two saves ago. this side then or down here all right so now we can run to the other side so stupid i pushed those fucking buttons and then it didn't even say oh it's at low power fuck you bitch something else. Doesn't something open or something? Oh, there we go. Now shit's happening. This area wasn't as bad as I remembered it. What the hell? Two days after we left? You're kidding me. Son 
sons of bitches. It isn't on the damn station. Repeat of aliens. Oh, excuse me, alien, I should say. important on this Apollo primary interaction log 11 11 21 37 class human interaction request for intercooperate corporate messaging received outgoing message to Wayland Yutani representatives accepted and monitored 11 16 21 37 class colonial martial incident report Temporary emergency measures initiated in San Cristobal medical facility no further information provided 11 17 21 37 class external interaction purchase order received Wayland Utani operational rule set packet received verified and installed 11 23 21 37 class colonial martial incident report emergency measures initiated in San Cristobal medical facility extended no further information provided station scans initiated under Wayland Utani directive number 00043 Bravo 56 11 24 21 37 class contamination contaminant hazard alert unverified scans in reactor system special order 939 initiated priority one protect specimen maintain station quarantine disallow communications 12 11 21 37 class Sevestival arrivals log new inhabitants logged with apollo assistance by synthetic staff ripley amanda level 2 Wayland yutani taylor nina level 4 Wayland yutani samuels Christopher, level 3, Wayland Yutani, expendable. 12 11 2137. Class containment hazard alert. Viable threat to specimen detected in product KG 348 hazard lab. Containment hazard alert raised to Omega. Keep things quiet. Steady, it's ransom. With the Wayland Yutani buyout, it's more important than ever that the flight recorder handover goes without a hitch. They'll be low level execs and won't know jack about the buyout. But if they hear rumors about a disappearing problem, people problem, well, I don't want to rock the boat, and neither do you. Let's just keep everything nice and quiet. We don't want them having second thoughts. Oh, no, have significance in there. Go to engineering. Hello, there you go. All right, no flashing light of debt. Death on my adapter yet. I think that usually just gives me the 30 minute mark indication. You want contact with Carl? I'm here. What's the news? Paul is running Wayland Yutani protocols. It's what? Six and sold out. Wayland Yutani are in control of Apollo now. It's refusing to lift the lockdown. It says there's something up with the reactor. You're from the company. Tell it you don't give a shit and to do what you say. Sorry, Ricardo, but I'm small fry. Me, Samuels, Taylor, we all are. Guess if we amounted to anything, Apollo wouldn't be so ready to see us killed. Investigate the Sensoral Reactor. dealing with the synthetic problem. Okay. Something weird 
it's happening. Synthetics are on the fritz, so I found some guys to help me out. I sent one of them into a manufacturing room, but he never came out. Every door is locked, and he sure as hell couldn't fit through the air vent without a fight. But we don't know what to do. It doesn't seem right to keep working without looking for him, but there's nowhere to look. Our ship's over soon. I'll report the incident to Waits and the Marshals. Damn it, that was flashing. Right. More androids. Because I think at this point, human interaction is already done for. I think every human being left alive is dead at this point, if I remember correctly. I mean a computer a camera over there. So at least there's a vent I can climb in if need be. Come all the way this way. If you find this facility in a state that isn't to your liking, please let us know. He was going to another room, or if he was just... I know they can't go in the vents, obviously, but I don't think he'll, uh... This is an entirely unauthorized alert. Please stop interfering. I'm trying to figure out, is he still looking at me at the other vent, or is... That isn't authorized in this facility. You're going to hurt yourself. Oh, clearly this doesn't do very well for the vents. camera off. Heard something, but not sure. He's in the next room over or not. Why not ask me about the rest of all safety protocols? Why not ask me about not giving a shit?
You're starting to test my patience. Takes me. Okay, not flashing yet, so that's good. More cameras. If we can, all right. So I upgraded my cutting torch, but. to kill these damn cameras. Just dancing around the cameras. All right, so boom, the advanced cutting torch is policy for that. But if there's anything scrap-wise or whatever to pick up. I think that android will come back here since the cameras didn't pick me up and alert anybody. Time to cut, cut, cut. And how th does this not attract enemies? I don't know, but... Even though I did hear something in the distance. Yeah, like that doesn't make a lot, uh, make a lot of noise. Oh, let's just drop this heavy ass fucking door. But then again, it's just like that one scene that my brother-in-law was telling me in Alan Lake, where it's like you're trying to be hella quiet in one area, and then all of a sudden he's like being hella loud, like breaking these fucking boards to get to this one area. Yeah, and then no one hears that. I just saw a synthetic, but not sure if he saw me. Alright, still not flashing, so that's good. Uh, 
unless he's in an area where he can't get to me, but... Can he? He's just standing there, which is odd. Unless I have to go down here first before him to actually start moving. Go away, buddy. We forget the little details, but the the big picture. Shut up. What your route is. I'm pretty sure I gotta turn on these generators. Some of these animations are kind of on the slow side. If you find this facility in a state that isn't to your liking, please let us know. Generator? No, there's not. There's someone behind you, helping you every single step of the way. Yes, we stand behind you, and and later your mother. of it but sometimes I don't think we need your help all right and you go in a little bit farther at least so I can quickly do this real quick Tomorrow, 
this too. to go, buddy. Okay, so got the generator. If you find this facility in a state that isn't to your liking, please let us know. should be open I think now My device is still technically valid. Oh, I'm just going to need there, okay. Okay, cool. 
way. Tomorrow, together. That's it. Alright, nothing like crawling around and crawl spaces where water is dripping through. be surprised if it takes me back to where this dude is but we'll go ahead and just cut the store open just in case we need to get out of it one day or later on I should say going. Go ahead and save really quick. Do we have the flashing light of death? No. So we can go a little bit further. Push the stream a little bit further. I would like to have my freaking guns back. So they must have went in there. Tomorrow, together. Are they actually gonna come through the door? Or no? Okay, so we're gonna have to dance around the ones with the hazmat suits then. Why not ask me about Sebastopol safety protocols? Something for me. way or not. Alright, so I'm guessing when he comes when he doubles back doubles back around, then I have to just sneak right past him to get a little bit further. say.
experiencing a heightened containment hazard level today. Um, what's the comfort? <clears throat> or at least the voice that is. Because you live to serve. Come on. Double back around. We can get this over with. that way. Shit, that's not what I meant to do. We're experiencing a Strange. Shit, hopefully he didn't see that. Maybe he just heard the noise and that's about it. There are more pressing matters. Yes, like you coming back around this way so I can fucking get past you. need to keep sitting in this locker for like freaking ever, dude. All visiting corporate representatives must report to their nearest synthetic. On way. Of course, you turn around, you fucking cocksucking little prick. Why not ask me about Sebastopol safety protocols? I hate about this damn game sometimes. <sighs> We're experiencing a heightened containment hazard level today. This could require my attention. Back to work. Really do some damage. This gun is actually nice to have. I usually save it for when I'm down in the core area. I want to make sure he takes a little walk first. No, oh my. This now he wants to spend more time on the other side. Watch. I just need him to come back and then leave again really quick so I can access this terminal. Of 
course, no time to actually read anything, probably. Unless he's actually going to be nice enough now. Nope. Here he comes. There he is. Now my question is, can you brain them in the back of the head and then they won't turn around because the, you know, or no, in my luck, they probably will turn around. Safety protocols. I don't have the shotgun on me, but I do have that. This bolt gun or whatever it is. We're experiencing a heightened containment hazard level today. Alright, so I will double back to the computer real quick once he leaves this area. I'll spend like a few seconds, so if you want to pause this at a later time to read these particular logs, be my guest. Which I'll probably have to read them at a later time too myself, so. so there's one log, tomorrow. six, eight, three, two. Gave a little bit of time for you guys to quickly pause if you're catching this well not live but I guess if you're catching this later on or if you check catch this on Z YouTube get in there same thing happened with me with the alien ones too luckily the alien didn't catch my ass alright so I'm getting the blinking light of death so hopefully I can get back to a Save point before this kill's over. Something amiss. Good thing his reaction speed's not that great. I have other concerns. That's right, you worry about those other concerns, so I can just get the fuck out of here. Oh, he went in there. I was going to say, I didn't even hear him walk. All right. Seekson, tomorrow, together. Seekson, tomorrow, together. Hmm. That's right, buddy. Hmm. I just need you to go into that other room. Since like a good android. That way I can get back to what I'm doing. Hopefully save. And we can call it good for right now. That way. Go. In the room. In the room. You didn't go in the room, you cocksucking fuck. All visiting corporate representatives must report to their nearest synthetic. <sighs> That's the one thing I always hated about this game is like... They go certain routes, but then all of a sudden, their routes all of a sudden can randomly change. Especially when you're hiding. It's like, dude, just continue going on your normal route so I can get the fuck out of here so we're not wasting my time, your time, and everyone else's time who's trying to watch this shit. Now go in the fucking room this time. One 
Don't ask me about Sebastopol safety protocols. Go in the fucking room! Even though I probably could have just went right there, they had plenty of time, but I'm trying to be a little too fucking overly cautious, which is fucking me over time wise. At least with the alien, it gives you the benefit of the doubt where it'll randomly go in the vent, so you kind of get false hope that it's good to go, but then just like that, he could pop right back out and be like, Surprise, motherfucker! I'm back to hunting you now. Alright. When he goes there, I'm just gonna fucking pop right out. See you Tomorrow. Together. Oh, now he goes back in the fucking room. Oh, I think he did. Alright. Oh, he, that's a different area, so I don't... He would have to go all the way around if he wanted to catch me. Get to a save point soon, or uh, yeah, that's the only way where I can pretty, clearly pretty much go. Call elevator. Now we wait. <clears throat> Not sure if this will take me to a loading, saving. Central reactor. Ricardo, you ever been to the reactor? Never took that at all. I did some training in one. It seems like a mm. lifetime ago. All right. All right. I hear a save point, which I would like to get to. up something in the left direction. Oh, looks like another weapon. Oh shit, I got my shit back. Okay, cool. Bolt gun. Alright, so we'll save the bolt gun. Because that's going to come in handy at a later point. Alright, so I think we will call it good here for right now. All right. Main menu. There we go. But mute this really quick. All right, everybody, thank you for joining. If you are now just catching me live, I apologize. This is the end of the stream. One, because my adapter for my HDMI cable to my x air glasses is uh, giving me the 30-minute blink of death. Um, I did find a 10-foot USB data cable because uh, I did see that my graphics card does have a USB Type-C port in the back, so maybe I might get one of those on Amazon. That way I can make longer streams with... Um, alien Isolation and other horror type games that I'm going to do with these extra air glasses. I don't have to worry about um, trying to keep them like two and a half hours or less. I think the longest stream I did in these is maybe two minutes and two hours and 45 seconds before uh, the adapter might have killed over. But uh, again, thank you for joining me. If you uh, made it this far, I would greatly appreciate a follow. And if you're catching this on YouTube on my YouTube channel, I would greatly appreciate a subscribe. And if you can, like and share. A uh, few shout-outs real quick. Uh, they're all affiliated, but of course, the more the merrier. But obviously, I would greatly appreciate if I can get seven more followers so I can get affiliated myself. But anyways, so be sure to follow my cousin at Terrible Terrors, all one word. My brother-in-law, 
Tolus underscore 64, and then my sister, Dragonfly Rain, all one word. Rain as in the game Blood Rain, not Rain in the Sky or Rain in Hell or any of that other shit. So until then, I will see you all in the next episode. Take care, everybody.